party of educational opportunity, and we're the party of shared responsibility. And that shared responsibility also came out in a small way that a lot of people didn't notice. But Georgia this year nearly forfeited $175 million in unemployment benefits, money that we have paid into a system that we refuse to take back. The federal government said, here's $175 million for all of your folks who have 99 who are about to exhaust their unemployment benefits. Mark Butler, our commissioner of labor, said no, that people were lazy and if they wanted a job, they just had to go to one of our one-stop centers, but that we didn't need the money. And more importantly, he said it on NPR, so he knew Democrats were listening. <laughs> so we got the tape, and we played it over and over again, including to Governor Deal. And I will say this, I, I've, I've worked with Governor Deal. I disagree with him a good bit of the time. But what I will say is, working with him, because Democrats also understand that we aren't just the Democratic Party of Georgia, we are a party of Georgia, and we are a part of Georgia. Yeah. And Democrats understand that we have to work across the aisle because not all of us have the same beliefs. We are the party, we are the coalition party because we understand that some of its parts make up the whole. And so when we worked with Governor Deal, we got $175 million into the hands of Georgia families as a shared responsibility. When Republicans were turning away, Democrats quietly put the pressure on to make sure those families got taken care of and we drew down those dollars. 